Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh! Hmm, what do we got here? What do we got here? I know nothing about this. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we are back here in Chicken Alfredo. Mm, I could go for some Chicken Alfredo right now. Anyway, uh, today's a very special video. I decided, let's go ahead and start building our little tiny village. The new update, we are able to rescale so many new items, including these small little birdhouses. We could basically scale them all the way to the ground, and I thought this would be perfect for our tiny little Blockburg village that I've been planning to make for a little while. It was also, it was a really cool idea suggested by one of my friends little birdhouses look at them can i fill up these birdhouses with gas just asking <laughs> so i've got another shot in my arm today for those that don't know what a village is um i googled it earlier too and basically it's smaller than a town usually located in like a rural area but it would look something like that um uh something like this but not really i don't know usually have like around 500 to 2500 people living in it mostly just the bird houses 260 dollars small wooden birdhouse and it can be resized with a scale tool yeah we got so many more objects that we can rescale now you could actually just put it on the floor isn't that cute that is cute so i thought we would make ourselves a nice little village now you can just combine a couple coffee tables is this still dumb probably like this is gonna be a pretty simple build very similar to my um little town or little city that i made but with little birdhouses instead what if i put a carpet up here <gasps> obviously you can probably put a carpet now up here right <gasps> wow oh my gosh you can scale the carpet hold on what wait i just realized you can scale the carpet oh Oh, I just learned new stuff. Oh my god, you can scale though. <gasps> what? I didn't know that! I didn't know that! All of the carpets are scalable now. <gasps> wow! Okay, so what I was thinking is using the carpets as like a, like as the dirt and maybe the grass or something. I don't know what color though. I feel like it would look really nice. And then you can put it on top. Let's just scale. Oh my gosh, you can scale this carpet. Oh, are we in a village now? Okay, uh, there's, we have a problem. I've never done a village before. Like, I've never built a village ever. I'm not too familiar with villages. I just know. I've seen them before. I've seen them before, but not too much. That's the thing. See, this is this is fun learning process for me. I'm learning. Maybe you're learning something. I hope so. In real life, that is possible. Like, your house could be way smaller than a huge tree, right? So, why don't we have the Christmas trees? Hold on. Why don't we have the little Christmas trees for this? <laughs> Okay, I think our only- our safest bet is to have like- <laughs> We're gonna use these holiday trees, these tiny holiday trees. Okay, that doesn't look like much. I need to add something else. A tiny village. I should have like the thumbnail of me like towering over this village. I don't know what kind of village I'm gonna go for. I don't even know if I'm making a really accurate one. I guess accurate is out the window at this point. <laughs> this is ugly. <laughs> Hold on. I have no idea. I still don't know what I'm doing, but I changed my little bird houses. Obviously, you can change the roof color anything you want to, so that's even better. Like, the thing with these tiny builds is that you do have to put in, like, some extra small details. Okay, uh, that might be something. We might be on to something. I still like the idea of having, like, a body of water somewhere, like a river of some sort. Then we could have, like, uh, some more houses down here. Like, a lot of houses, actually. We could have a tons and tons of house. But it's really cool how that you can use like carpets and stuff actually now. You can resize them. I didn't expect this carpet being able to this big. Oh wait, this is actually coming together a little bit better now. What else can we do for this village? This is, it's not looking too bad. I think I'm starting to, so this is like Animal Crossing inspired. Usually I have, I actually have this in my, my island. I have this kind of setup. The outside of the village though, it's not gonna look that great like the outer parts, but I think only thing that matters is the inside. Okay, what should we do now? What should we do now? Okay, let's add some, let's just put grass everywhere. Oh, there should be like, um, <gasps> what if I made a bridge? Oh, that would've been cool if I make a bridge or something. <gasps> I don't know if this is gonna work very well. I'm just gonna try it. No, we, the, the bridge could be like this, right? Can the bridge be like that? Because if it's just all flat, that might be a little bit boring. We need lots and terrain. Lots and lots of terrain. This is kind of cute, right? We have some houses along the river. We have some houses like in a village. Okay, so this is like, you know, this is a village, right? We need to add some like dirt around here too, like some paths. We need more paths. Okay. I don't know. I want to make like little rocks. I'm not sure if this really, this is not really too rock-like. The only cool thing about this village is this part. This is probably the most effort there. Everything else is just, you put a house down, that's it. <laughs> I think we need more light posts. We need more lights. 
some more lights. Really though, like making tiny little miniature like stuff really makes you pay attention to the smallest details ever. So if you ever want to uh, prove on detailing and stuff, I think this is good practice as well. I don't think I'm that great at it still, but it really does help you pay attention to the smaller details. And that's what I really want to improve on is doing more details, improving on my landscape this year. And I think that's mostly, yeah, I don't know, maybe try to learn more different house types or house structures and stuff. These are supposed to be lights. Don't worry about it too much. Can I actually put like small lights on those? Ooh, we can make the birdhouse. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Okay, if we raise the houses a little bit like so, because it is sinking inside the grass a bit, the, the shape of grass rug thing, we can actually make it look proper and just standing up like that. Yeah, this is a bit of a hazard. What if I just put like safety fences above like that? I just think if you fill up this whole little table with a bunch of houses, you're good, you're good. Wow, it looks so cute far away. It looks very, very cute far away. Let's just sprinkle some more random trees in places and call it a day. <laughs> we'll just call it a day. Also, I don't know if I will be good enough tomorrow. I'm gonna try and maybe record a video, tonight, another video tonight. Oh, we'll see. I did get shot in my arm. Again, I don't know how bad it's gonna hit me tomorrow. I Ooh, there you go. More trees. We're gonna make use of the trees everywhere. So we have trees, we have dirt, a couple of rock path things. Can I call this a village and just be done? Um, I mean, it's cute. There was effort, okay? There was effort. Uh, it took me 47 minutes. <laughs> it's not even an hour. Should I spend more time on it? I should spend more time. Hold on. Okay, we have more trees. I used up like a lot of the small trees. I don't even know if I need a big tree. Should I just put one giant one right there? That's too many trees. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> I feel like I just sprinkled rocks into like chocolate batter cake batter and I just laid it inside the pan like that. What in the world? Can I be done? I'm finished. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now, I think the village is mostly there. Color more of these like houses and stuff. I think we just need more color. Right now it's just a lot of a lot of greens, you know. Okay, how about now? Okay, that's a little bit Oh it's so cute, guys. It's so cute. That looks so cute! Okay, I'm done. That's my village, guys. Alright. I think it's dark now. I don't think we can see it too well in the dark. Oh my gosh, look at it. <gasps> can I do tiny little string lights around the place? Hold on. I think it'd be cool if we made like little lights. I don't know how little, but uh what would be a little lamp? <gasps> wait! What wait 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 I why don't I use like these for the lamps? Oh my gosh, I'm so dumb. Okay, hold on. We need that warm lighting as always. Why was I making these lamps? You see these lamps? I literally could just do this. I could just do that. And that's what, oh my gosh, okay. I could have just done that and it'll actually light up the place. It'll light up the actual thing. Okay, let's get rid of these. I don't know why I, I made those. I thought I was being very innovative. I thought I was crafty when I did that. Not very crafty. That's just dumb. That was just dumb, okay. Okay, now I can see it in the dark. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> As always with my builds, there are some questionable things. Some very some things that don't make sense, but like overall, look at this. <gasps> wow, look at my village, guys. Wow. I got a river, two bridges. And then you got like an area over here, here. I just think of villages as just houses, so there's no like community buildings really. Um, but wow, this actually looks kind of nice. Wow, it's cute. It's cute. It's cute. It's cute. I still like this. And you can turn off the lights too. And if you don't want, if like everyone's asleep, I don't know. So yeah, this is what it looks like during nighttime. And I actually really like it at night. This is really nice. But during the day, here's a, a better in detail, more detailed look at it. For someone like me, I think it's a decent job. Uh, I think I did okay. And I, I, I learned a lot more about using shapes, you know? It's fun putting shapes together and making little things with them. But yeah, I think that's it. Wow. Okay. Okay, that's my that's my village. My tiny village. I'm Godzilla. I'm Godzilla again. But anyway, guys, that's basically it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, you found it dumb, inspiring, in a way, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And make sure you hit the subscribe button too because it is completely free. And it, you know, you can always unsubscribe whenever. So uh, just do it because it is free, of course. But yeah, thank you guys for taking the time already to watch this. I will talk to you in the next upcoming videos. Stay healthy. Stay safe. Have a wonderful day. Peter Bread signing out. Goodbye, everybody.